What's good, Grey Gang? We're back in the basement. We've not been here in like a really long time, have we? We got the silver play button right there. We got the fan wall stretching from all the way over here. And then over here, we have the signed bait pack wall. Which, if you don't know right up there, that's a bunch of bait packs. But it's not only bait packs, but it's bait packs that you, fellow Grey Gangsters, have signed your name on them, sent them in, and we've stuck them up on there. And as you see, guys, well... That's pretty massive, okay? That's a big wall. And we've still got all this space down here to cover up. So, you know, if you have one, if you want to send one in, send it on in. The P.O. box is, well, I'll pop it up right here. And it's also in the description. Just go ahead and send us in one if you want us to pop it up on the wall. We would love it to have your name on my wall. It would be astounding. But anyways, we're about to do a mail time right here. We've not done a mail time in forever. But that ain't gonna stop us. We're gonna start it off. This one is from Delilah Shiskeski. Something like that. It's pretty close, so I promise. Here we go! Boom! Hey, this is a mystery tackle box, and it's actually like really close. I mean, it is a mystery tackle box, but they even sent some of the baits that came in there. They sent like these little brush hog little things, watermelon. These came in a few months ago. And you know, I'm just gonna be honest with y'all, I ain't try to hide none. I've not opened mail in a while, guys. I just had I've But also in here, we have looks like a little pin right here. It's from the Florida Ducks Unlimited. Sounds important. Next up, we have this, and it doesn't have a name on it, but it's kind of squishy. But it also wraps. I'm gonna make a prediction right here. I'm gonna say one rattle trap and 18 worms. I know, guys, that's a lot of stuff. But this envelope is nothing less than heavy. Not really, but it is like a half a pound. And that's a heavy envelope, people. You gotta understand. Envelopes aren't supposed to weigh much. Oh, whoa. I may have been extremely right. If I was right, I'm gonna die, dude. Well, not really. I was right. I knew it. I'm basically a professional. We have one rattle trap right here. Nice little chartreuse indistinctable sound and i'm not gonna count these but i'm gonna say this is about 18 worms actually i am gonna count them one two three four five six seven eight nine, nine, nine. i was a, okay so i was about to say 11 but i accidentally said 18 okay you feel me so basically i was 100 percent right but that's not all that was in here we also got this which is some kind of coin canadian two dollars oh and i got this one and this one is a canadian one dollar sounds like i just got three canadian dollars richer it's always a good thing next Oh, this one come from Joey Brown. Uh, this one is another MTV box. Oh, I should have guessed it. But then again, there's no way I could have guessed it. We got little trout something. It's called a trout inno. Sort of like a minnow. I'm going to call that a trout minner because I don't say minnow for some reason. I don't know. And then also got these. If it will ever focus, you may be able to see it. Focus on them, not me. Okay, yeah. See, it's like a little orange scrounger. Here. This next one is a pretty big one. It's from Alexa... Autumn and Russell. Oh, this is awesome. Look at all those stamps. We got some dog streets for Lucky and Sheba, tell you, son. Okay, there's two bags, three bags, four bags. Just kidding. But we do have a first aid kit in case I hurt myself, which I do pretty often. But then way down here in the bottom, we got some baits down in here. And this blue thing, which I don't know what it is. What's it say it is? Oh, homemade slime. That works too. Mosquito repellent band. And some hand sanitizer along with some weight. And a crank bait. So now, not only can I go fishing and catch fish, but I can stay mosquito free while being very sanitized. And if I, just in case my hook myself, I will not die because I have a first aid kit. This boy is now safe. Don't worry guys, I'm not gonna die. But now now we have a small but heavy package from Troy Hitchcock, and I do feel some metal. Or really hard plastic, I'm not sure. Oh, oh wow, whoa, yes, yeah, I needed these, yeah. We got some man's jelly worms. These aren't your normal worms, people. These things are 12 inches long. But generally, what you're gonna do with a giant worm is these are for big summertime bass. In the summertime, the water's hot, the bass really don't wanna move much. And instead of a bass wanting to go find five shad that that's big, they prefer for one big meal like this big worm. And that's exactly what I needed because I didn't have any. Thanks, Troy. You also sent right here a bait pack for the wall. I'm gonna put that one right there. We'll glue that up here in a minute, don't worry. But he also sent two knives right here. We got one Gerber. And then this one right here, which is a bigger one. This one is a shear field. This one's ready to do some damage. Hmm. Congratulations, Kendall. You just ruined an entire roll of paper towel. And just in case you know they get dull, I also got these knife sharpener in with the deal. While we're at it, I mean, he did give a knife sharpener, so we're gonna sharpen it. Now, if you don't know how to sharpen a knife, it's not exactly the hardest process. All you do is you take the blade, you take this end. This end is the coarse side. It has a coarse side and a fine side. Coarse is to, like, really shave away the metal, get it sharper. Fine is to just, like, refine it, make it fine-tuning your knife, I guess. But all you're gonna do, this is pretty simple. You stick it in there and pull it back. I'm 
I'm not exactly a professional, but I do know a little bit how to sharpen a knife. And then I'm fine with that, but if you really wanted to do it, you'd just turn it over, do the same thing with the fine thread right here. Just like this. And then that's all you do, sharpen a knife. Except you don't only do it three times. Like, you gotta do it a lot more than that. I honestly probably didn't even make a difference in this knife. And then right here, come from Taylor Leverett. Oh, yeah, baby. I got a glove. I got two gloves. I'm gonna put those on for the rest of the video. But before I tell you what's in this package, I just wanna remind you, if you wanna buy some merch, whether you wanna hat, a t-shirt, a fanny pack, a gray gripper, if you wanna buy some merch, it really helps out the channel. It allows me to afford to, you know, keep doing fun stuff. Like, go out and buy a kayak when I need them. But if you do wanna check out the merch, kennelgray1.com slash shop, or it should be the first First link in the description. And now let's get on into you know what's in the package. Right here, it's like a little chatterbait, but it's got a scrounger head on it. If you don't know what a scrounger head is, it's sort of like a chatterbait. Except the little chatter part on a scrounger head is made out of like sort of stiff plastic sheet thing. I don't really know how to explain it. But that's basically what it is. Along with that, we also got a couple hot hands in here. And I also want to let you guys know that if you did send mail and I didn't necessarily open it on camera, don't worry guys, that doesn't mean that I don't appreciate it. Every single thing that is sent in, I appreciate it 100%. Even if it's just a letter, don't think I skip it guys. I read every letter that comes in. But anyways, Grey Gang, you don't know. Get the merch. Also, if you want to send in a fan outro, just go outside, get your phone on the selfie cam, video yourself doing a fan outro. Make it about 10 15 seconds long, something like that, and then just send it into this email right here. And if you don't exactly know what to say in your fan outro, make it something a little bit like this one. For watching Kindle Gray Outdoors. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and do so. If you want some awesome merch, go to kindlegray1.com slash shop. Hashtag Gray Gang, hashtag Jesus.